Hey guys, how do you do? Welcome to the program users. Today we're going to continue with our material of the JS series of tutorials that we had started earlier on. Today we're going to see how to make a custom alert dialog right here. So you can see this is what I'm talking about. If I click my button right here, it's going to show me this particular alert dialog. You can see we have the title for the alert dialog right here. We have the content. Now check out of the content, for instance, we've made this one bold, we've also applied some italics to it, okay? The content section actually, we're going to see how to display, of course, HTML right here in the content section of our alert dialog. So this is it, is this simple, it's a simple tutorial of how to make a custom alert dialog and show it right here with our material view.js. Okay, so the first thing, of course, that we're going to come, let's just come right here to our site. We already have the text tutorial right here as well as the source code. So we come right here. If we come, click this one, it's going to bring us uh, right here to our page uh, for this particular tutorial. Okay, so what we're going to do actually, first, we're going to have some dependencies as you can see right here first. Our material icons so we're going to include the dependencies of course in the header section of our HTML document we're also going to have the view material the view.js core as well as the uh, view material library right here okay if we come over here no just come right here to edit the project just come right here click uh, this one right in fact you can also just edit it right here or open a new tab with the project now you can see of course we have the HTML section as well as the JavaScript uh, section right here so for this HTML of course the first thing we've said we're going to include are these particular dependencies once we have them then we're going to have this particular let me just expand uh, this one in fact let me just have two sections right here we're going to have these dependencies right here we're going to include them of course two of them are script view.js library the minified version we're fetching them from the cdn as well as the view material library okay then we have div id app id this is just a div tag right here inside it you can see we have the md dialog alert remember we're using the view material library so the title we're going to give it my alert the title was simply referencing it from our javascript we'll see it um, in a short while then at open we're going to call a function called on open right here at close we're also going to call a function called on close okay that's it then of course we're going to also have a button right here a button added let me just uh, have display this one right here so you can see the button we also have our button right here which when clicked okay at click native when our button is clicked we're going to call a function called open dialog then we're going to pass in the reference to the dialog now you can see right here we have the dialog for right here which of course is the reference uh, for this our MD uh, dialog alert now we come right here the first thing view.use remember this uh, view.js right here we was using the view material library so just come right here view.use view material then for app new view okay the element that we're targeting is the app id then of course uh, the data we come right here we're going to have this my alert object we pass in two properties first the title now the title right here I'm calling I uh, have my here journal space because then the content HTML so right here journal read that uh, Jupiter then of course strong now you can see we are playing the HTML tags right here in the content section we're making it bold we also are playing the italics in 2016 okay then now we come to the next section which is the methods right here so we're going to have first the open dialog is a function we simply call uh, this dot refs right here. This is going to reference for us, of course, the dialogue. Okay, you can have multiple dialogues. 
so we just are referencing right our dialog for then we call the open function is going to open it then close dialog when close dialog it is called where this is the ref okay we're being passed the reference for the dialog right here okay which in this case is dialog for then we call the close is going to close it now on open we're going simply to say console.log open then on close uh right here console.log are closed that's it that's what we're going to have right here then of course if we come to the output section you can see we have our alert dialog this you can simply come right here then of course uh just fork this project and then of course edit it as you guys wish okay and this does it does it make sure that you guys subscribe to our channel if you love this particular class we'll continue publishing more with js and other javascript framework tutorials so make sure you subscribe so that you don't miss out and also i uh, like the video share it take care i'll catch you in the next class